guys, so as you can see, I'm obviously wearing new clothes and that's because the first part of this video I did yesterday when I uh, had to obviously download the game again and it took basically all day, literally. I had nothing else to do, so I went and watched um, some anime in my room because download was going super slow. So, new day, and I can finally play this game now. So that's, um, see, I'm not sure if I want to just do it from the beginning again. Cause I mean, um, I could probably do it from, just go through it again, and then I get up to that next bit that I stopped from the demo. Or I wonder if, hmm, I most likely have to do it from the beginning, so enough chit chat, let's go. Now I remember how to uh, play this, <laughs> so it'll be a lot easier now. film little pieces of time but he could be talking about photography as he likely was okay i'm in class everything's cool i'm okay from light to shadow from color to chiaroscuro now can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in i life? didn't fall asleep and that sure didn't feel like a dream Bueller. weird Hi again Arbus. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. We feel like totally haunted by the eyes of those sad mothers and children. She saw humanity as tortured, right? And frankly, it's bullshit. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. I think there's nothing wrong with that picture. It looks great. Keep that to yourself. Seriously, though, I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that to me. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What I if can't I believe I still have this pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st century. But I like it old school. So she could have taken another approach. I have to admit, I'm not a big fan of her work. I prefer... Robert Frank. Me too, Victoria. 
He captured the essence of post-war beat America. I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie, a dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has always been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Um, you're asking me? <laughs> can anyone remember what I chose the first time? You're asking me? Well, let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? <laughs> Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Very good, Victoria. The daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces making them extremely popular from the 1800s onward. The first American daguerreotype soft portrait was done by... My Robert little camera bag is battered, but still kicking. You can find out all about them in your textbook, or even online. But guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo on the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Melissa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Now let's just... That was amazing when Mr. Jefferson took a class picture the first week. Even though I didn't want to be in the picture at all, it was very fucking cool to watch him at work framing us. Okay. Well, yeah, the uh, voice is definitely, um, Dan. The correct use of colors. Oh, that looks beautiful. Let's, uh, go on the computer. What are we doing here? Somebody was already recognized. Oh. Can we, uh, can we check YouTube? <laughs> I'm pretty sure most people say that when they see a computer in a game. I've noticed photo equipment. That almost looks like my one that I have sitting right over there. But, you know. Okay, what's this? Oh, it looks like a journal. Um, guessing these people. Episode. Uh-huh, SMS. Have a very special 18th birthday. You're an adult now, but you're still a little girl. Check your account. Don't blow it all at once. Ooh. You got me money, did you? Hey, Max, are you around? Always okay? Did you want to get tea late today? Absolutely. I'll be free after four. Talk to you later. What does mom have to write? Happy birthday, Maxine. Can't believe it's been a whole 18 years since you were brought to us. Mm hmm. Warren, here's this. Well, clearly she ain't replying to you. I think she's ignored that message, alright. Okay, um, can I talk to her? Speak. Okay. Oh. Hi, Hope I didn't embarrass you. You seem quiet today. You seem quiet today. 
Just thinking too much. Look at that hair. <laughs> I hear that. Wanna go grab a cup of tea and bitch about life? Thanks, but not today. I have to go over home. No worries. Let's hang later. Yes, let's hang later. Paper ball that was thrown. Throw it back at her. I wasn't actually supposed to take a photo of that. Ah, oh, am I going to achieve it for it anyway? That's cool. Mr. Jefferson, speak to you. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse you. No, it's excuse, excuse us. <laughs> Never let one of photography's future stars avoid handing in location. Okay. Do I have to? I just don't think it's that big a deal. Max, you're a better photographer than a lot. Now, I know it's a drag to hear some old dude like shit, but life won't wait for you to play catch up. You're young, the world is yours, blah, 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 right? <laughs> but you do have a gift. You have the fever to take images, to frame the world only the way you envision it. Now, all you need is the courage to share your gift with others. That's what separates the artist from the amateur. Got it. Why do I have the option to look at it? Every time I'm with Victoria, I feel like she's talking small about me. Yeah, she probably could be. Alright. That's TV, that's poster. That's books. This is a door that we want to go out of. And we're out! She looks like she's just about to judge a whole lot of people. I need a serious time on the back. Splash water on his face and make sure I don't look like his tongue. Quietness. I wonder what she's listening to. <laughs> Don't text and drive. What are you looking at? Huh? Huh? What are you looking at? So just stand around on our phones. Okay, is this my locker? Why is it? Uh, I was gonna say why is it different colors though everyone else, but then I just realized that, you know. It's different. Open! I love that picture of mom and dad. Hello, Jack. Kiss, kiss. And you look totally fabulous as usual. Okay, then. That's great. Alright, so what we're doing, we're going to the bathroom. That's right. Okay. Where is this bathroom? Missing person poster. No, I don't want to look at her. Bathroom, here we go. Can I run? Uh, can I, like speed walk? Enter. Empty, good. Nobody can see my meltdown, except for me. And everyone else is watching this. <laughs> Nice to know. Yes. This is when the. Just relax. Stop torturing yourself. You have the gift. Fuck it. I would have kept that. This is when the butterfly comes out, isn't it? Yeah, I remember. When the door closes, the window opens. Or something like that. 
You don't get a photo off like this every day. Yeah, you'd have to be like extremely slow just to get a bloody picture of that. I want that camera, that's so cool. Well, not that one exactly, but I'm sure there's new ones out there that look better. <laughs> do doing it here. Can you do that in the men's toilet? You own the scoop. If I want it, I could blow it up. You're the boss. So what do you want? I hope you check the perimeter, as my step ass would say. Now, let's talk business. I got nothing for you. Wrong. You got hella cash. That's my family, not me. Oh, boo hoo, poor little rich kid. I know you've been pumping drugs and shit to kids around here. I bet your respectable family would help me out if I went to them. Man, I can see the headlines now. Leave them out of this bitch. I can tell everybody Nathan Prescott is a punk ass who begs like a little girl and talks to himself. You don't know who the fuck I am or who you're messing around with. Oh, he got a gun. He got a gun. Ever tell me what to do. I'm so sick of people trying to control me. You are going to get in hella more trouble for this than drugs. Nobody would ever even miss your punk ass, would they? That got away from me, my god. Oh, snap. Down goes the gun. Oh. What the fuck? My thoughts exactly. <laughs> I was in the yep, he was. He shot that poor girl. He did. I held up my hand, and then I was back here. See here and listen to this dude talk again. Now Kate is being hassled again. And if Victoria's following, this is real. Oh my god, it's real. You broke your camera. How are you supposed to use that to take a picture of a freaking butterfly? I might as well go all the way. Can I actually reverse time? Why are this? Oh, right now. Okay. Here we go. That's better. Perfectly captured. Good camera back. Anybody? Okay, well I'm assuming to get it. We're gonna have to take the selfie. Why are these? Titles images of hopeless things. Perfect timing, take better. If you don't again, I'll know this is for real. A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. We missed half that. I know I'm not dreaming this. It's real. I can tell. Your generation. So I can go back in time. Selfie expression. What if that girl isn't dead yet? Can I save her? Can I save her? I'm assuming it's point. I need to go to the bathroom quickly and check it out. Now, Max, since you captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self portraits? I'm sorry. I feel sick. May I be excused? <laughs> <laughs> but you're not going to get away with it. Uh, I'll just choose a book. Is there anybody? Shit. Jefferson wants to keep me after class. And I need time to save that girl. The process to get close with is sharp reflective style, like a mirror. I can only wait to pull this stuff in my head down. I'll say it. Very good, Victoria. What if I rewind again and give him the right answer? That's good. Do I have to rewind it all the way back to the beginning? Or is this... Yeah. Okay. Skip that. Here you go. The Jagarian process. 
invented by a French painter named Louis de Guerre around 1830s. Somebody has been reading as well as posing. <laughs> nice work, Max. Hey. <laughs> the process made portraiture hugely popular, mainly because it gave the subjects clear defined features. You can learn more when you actually finish reading the assigned chapters. Max is so far away. That's right. Went ahead of everyone else. Look at the clothes they wear to school. Jesus Christ. Okay, well, I'm assuming I'm going to have to chitty chatty to him again before I can get out of here. Excuse me, Mr. Jefferson, can I talk to you for a moment? Yes, excuse him. No, Victoria, excuse us. I've never let one of photography's future stars. Skip. Either I will whine or I can't. I have no idea what's going on. I feel like I'm on like heaps of drugs right now. Okay. I had to uh, change one of the the keys for it. Um, I guess I have to speak to him again. Let's not just click the space button yet. <laughs> we'll just have to let him talk. Um, so I've actually got three um, unboxing videos coming soon when the boxes come in. I've got Loot Crate and two others. I think uh, Nerd Block, which is the arcade one, and some super nerd one or something. So those will hopefully come in. The Loot Crate one that I got is actually the gaming one, not just the normal Loot Crate, but the gaming one. So I think that's coming in hopefully in the next week or so. So I'll have those to do which would be cool um, and exciting if I had to buy a couple of um, shelves and stuff in my room so I can put all the all the stuff on it but there'll probably be some stuff that I'm not gonna want um, so I might maybe do some like giveaways and stuff for you guys um, so after I do an unboxing video, I'll go through what I want to keep and what I don't want to keep and then I will either upload a photo of it all and I don't know, put it on Twitter and all that stuff and you guys can like message me or something or you know, comment something. Maybe I'll do it when I'm doing the video. I'll say at the end which ones I'm keeping, which ones I'm not, and you guys can comment um, which ones you want, and then, you know, obviously I can discuss with you and stuff, postage and everything. So yeah, let's get on with the game. <laughs> Just thought I should tell tell you guys that. Um, so it's going to be cool when I do that. And I'll make sure when I do the videos I have the other half of Dragonborn with me because... And it'd just be cooler with another person. I'm doing it by myself. Alright. John Lennon. I love John Lennon. Just let me say that. <laughs> I think John Lennon said that life is what happens while you're busy making people happy. Thank you. Sure you're wearing eyeliner, sir. <laughs> Okay, I can leave now. So, open. Oh, don't let me idiot running down the hallway. 
I'm just just busting out of the toilet. It's all good. Who are these two people here? Yeah. Okay. Enter. Okay, Max. I'll retrace every step. I washed my face. Yep. Washed my hair. Yep. Then butterfly went. And you took a picture. How did you not hear him talking? Get it. Okay, so I have it already, so... Hammer! But let's just leave. What a bully! Uh, do I leave? Am I leaving? I'm not talking here. Let's just get out of here. There, that was fun. Ah, great. something wrong. Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. You, he's being creepy. Hide the truth. I just got sick in class. Um, female children. Except you're wandering around like a zombie. And do you think that's the first time a student has used that line on me? It's the truth. I felt dizzy in Mr. Jefferson's Just class. tell me what you're hiding. You can trust me. There's nothing to hide. I got sick. It happens, you know. There's that team two to get. You know, I've, I've heard it. Don't think I don't know what goes on around here. <laughs> You've only been here for three weeks, and you're already causing conflict. I don't think your parents will approve when they find out. Oh. Class, please. No, he does not buy that at all. I may have just flushed my scholarship down the toilet. Okay. I could rely on actually telling the truth. Don't wander around, kid. Get on outside. Yeah. I wonder what happens if we do the other option. Don't worry, sir. I'm not actually touching you. <laughs> No, I just saw someone take a gun out and go to shoot someone. Is that all you're thinking about? You could always be a front of the max. But if you tell or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Well, Max, talk to me. God. 
Report him. I just saw Nathan Prescott. Where have you been on him? In his grocery. Nathan Prescott. You sure? Yes. He was in the bathroom talking to himself with a gun. I saw everything. He was babbling like crazy. Okay, slow down. Slow down. So now you saw this without him seeing you. I was hiding behind a stall. I have the right to be here. It's the group room. I know, I know. I just want to be completely clear what happened. Mr. Prescott happens to be from the town's most distinguished family and one of Blackwell's most honored students. So it's hard for me to see him brandishing a weapon in the girl's bathroom. So what happened next? Then, then he left. I ran out here wondering what to do. Are you going to bust him? This is serious charge. I'll look into the matter first. Thank you for bringing it to my attention. That's it? After what I told you? We'll continue this discussion later in my office. Please go outside with the rest of your class. But the dude out there has got a gun. Of course this academic drone won't do anything since the Prescott family owns Blackwell now. Should I rewind and change my story? I don't what I have the options do I have? Let's try. Meow. When you hit that part and you slow down heaps. Speed up. Alright. Is there another option? Can I just look at him without speaking to him? You look a little stressed out. Are you okay? I'm I'm just a little worried about my future. You're sweating pinballs. Is that all Pinballs, that's a new one. <laughs> Or have you done something wrong? Is that it? Okay, let's just hide the truth. I just got sick. And we'll skip it. <gasps> really, fun. <gasps> Going outside. Okay, so that was the end of the video, so I hope you guys all enjoyed it. I'm definitely enjoying this game and I can't wait to do part two. So uh, like, subscribe, all that, and I'll talk to you guys all later. Bye! So this is it. I've um, got my chair, I've got my camera, keyboard, mouse, got Link and Zelda sitting in there, and I have my three monitors.